name is Derek Smith, and I'm a career strategist with the Academic Advising and Career Center. Over the next few minutes, I will be your guide as you walk through the process of understanding what LinkedIn is all about using the advanced search. Use LinkedIn's advanced search option to do a search on your favorite companies. Find out who of your connections is associated with those companies and make a list. If they are a client or service provider, you can ask what it's like to do business with them. Get creative and have fun doing your research so you can navigate how to best approach the company for a job when you're ready. Setting up a profile is only one of the many resources LinkedIn has to offer. To really take advantage of this resource as a job searcher, a young aspiring career professional, and a life learner, LinkedIn has what you need to support you. It's a hub of professional resources and a window into the employment market, hundreds of different professionals, industries, and companies. Plus, it posts jobs, all at your fingertips. Knowing what is there and how to use it is key. So let's get started. We will take a look at each feature, how to access it, and how to benefit by it. So let's get started. We will take a look at each feature, how to access it, and how to benefit by it. This is a list of what you can access through the advanced search tool. Your guide has several videos listed to show you different LinkedIn resources and provides a demonstration on how to navigate the system, how to use this feature, and the benefits of each feature. I suggest you save these links so that you can watch them again until you're comfortable navigating the system and feel confident that you've mastered the resource. Doing a search for a university is a great way to connect with alumni who went to the same school as you. You can reach out to them and share common interests, connect and get informed about their career path, the industry they work in, what is new and emerging in the profession, all which can help you in securing your next job. Using the alumni tool, you can first join or follow your alumni university and then search for past alumni at companies or places of employment you're interested in. You can see how many degrees of separation you may have from the alumni at your school or other schools you've attended. You can identify those alumni who are in positions that you aspire to and review their credentials, academic credentials, work experience, transitions from one position, and or other companies. When you do this research, pay attention to trends and consistencies that will help you determine what you need to tailor and highlight from your experience. You may want to reach out to those alumni to discuss their careers, get some inside information on their industry that will help position yourself to enter the workforce. Expanding your reach includes adding your connections, those people you already know, and perhaps people you want to get to know. Start with who you know. You can use the search bar and type in a person's name, or if you want to go to My Network and click on that tab, it will open your network and show you profiles of people you may know. Selecting one by one may take a lot of time and become tedious. Instead, you can use the More Options feature on the left-hand side that will bring you to a page to connect with your address book. If you type in your email address and agree to provide access to your contact list, LinkedIn will import and store your contacts to suggest connections and show you relevant updates. It's a quick and easy way to build your connections. Using the alumni tool, groups, and company pages will help grow and build your connections and network. Always connect online after meeting in person. Remember, avoid generic notes. Be brief, polite, and professional. This process of connecting and building your network is important now as a job seeker and will continue to be important as a career professional. Look up and pick five alumni you want to connect with. Consider what makes them a valuable connection for you and your career. Consider what you may have to offer them. Remember, building connections is about relationships that are reciprocal. LinkedIn groups are hubs on LinkedIn, which provide a place for professionals in the same industry or similar interests to share content, find answers, post and view jobs, make business contacts, and establish themselves as industry experts. Being relatively new in the workforce and as a young career professional, understanding the industry, the ebb and flow of the industry, what is changing, new and forecasting, is important to learn. 
Being part of a group will give you access to expertise, experience, insider information, insight, and advice. It will help you make new connections and give you access to new job opportunities. Please see your guide for a LinkedIn resource on how to use groups. Please take a moment to look at three to five groups you want to join and then go ahead and join them. Following companies can help you find companies where you want to work. A company page helps LinkedIn members learn about their businesses, brand, product, and services, and job opportunities. The benefit of following a LinkedIn company includes receiving both updates from the company and any jobs that might be posted. Companies of interest will also share relevant information from other sources and post their own blogs or updates from their website. You can see who works at the company. You can watch what is happening at the company in terms of growth and staff movement. This can be advantageous when you are job searching. Should you know someone who has joined them, you will then have an inside connection. This is particularly useful as a job seeker. LinkedIn helps you stay abreast of the jobs available at the companies you're interested in. Please see your guide for the company search resource. Please take a moment to complete the following activity. Pick three to five companies you're most interested in following. Choose companies in the industry sector. You can choose to follow companies in other industries too, giving you a broad range of information. Another compelling reason to build your network is to secure referrals. Work with trusted search firms, gain internal access. Most jobs are found through direct connections and LinkedIn can help you find employers to connect to. The hidden job market can be a vast untapped resource to find employers. You can either reach out to existing contacts or create your own connections to access opportunities that otherwise may not have been seen by you. Job boards. Probably the reason most people first join LinkedIn. The quality and quantity of job postings is high. You can search by company industry, profession, job title. You can set up email alerts for new job postings daily. You can search the company, employees with the company, employees in the same position to get a better understanding of what the company is looking for and values in its employees. You can connect with someone at the company to do research, get advice, insight, and career information. LinkedIn shows you similar positions to the job posting that you may want to consider or look at to expand your research and understanding of the career choice. Researching companies directly. This is another way to access the hidden job market. Researching people who work for companies can give you insight into the profession, their career path, the company, and what it is looking for in its employees. Making quality connections with those people gives you access to jobs that may not be posted, but rather are hired through referral. And where that is not the case, at minimum you know more about the company and how to position yourself as a qualified, if not desirable candidate. Please see your handout for a link that speaks more about this. If you come across someone either online through your research using LinkedIn or at an event that you know and want to follow up with, it is important to follow the etiquette common to users of LinkedIn. Remember this is a professional site, more formal than other social media sites or casual sites like Facebook. Messages need to be personalized and customized if you are sending it to someone you don't know well or have just met. For instance, if you're following up with someone you met at a networking event, remind them of the meeting, where you met, and why you want to continue to connect with them. For instance, if you're following up with someone you met at a networking event, remind them of the meeting, where you met, and why you want to continue the connection. Do you want to ask for advice or to keep in touch to follow up on some information, pass along an article, and so on? Keep the messages brief and to the point. There's a new feature, a chat feature. You can only send messages to people that you're first connections with. Otherwise, if you're not connected to someone that you want to be connected to, you need to send a connection request. In your request, follow the same etiquette Customized message, polite and professional, provide context and purpose. 
Generally speaking, requests made on a mass to strangers are not viewed favorably and often ignored or declined. Your connections represent you and become part of your brand. Choose wisely quality over quantity. Please see your guide for more information about sending messages. Another feature that can help you keep up to date in industry information, thought leadership, and other industry news is the news feed. Staying current will not only help you in your job search, it will help you speak to what is pressing and important in the industry during an interview and understand how events may influence change in your industry. Please see your guide for a link with more information on news feeds. Sharing your own content. This is a way to show your expertise, what you value, and to stand out from the crowd. The more you share, the more you get known. Please see your guide for a link that will provide you with more information about sharing content. LinkedIn is an incredible resource as a job seeker and career professional. Learn it and use it. Thank you for your time. For more help, please visit the Academic and Advising Career Center and make an appointment with one of our career staff who can help you further on your journey.